Hello my dear, this is Vijal Kumar Sen and in this video tutorial you are going to learn about permeability. Uh, basically, you know, uh, this is uh, a topic of metal casting and uh, obviously I am going to share with you all numerical problems, uh, formula based numerical problems. Of course, without formula how could it be possible you can solve numerical. So let's go for its permeability. Basically, what is it? If I will share with you the definition then probably you will understand uh, what is permeability so definition is here right so what is the what is the definition of permeability ability ability of the molding sand to allow the gases to escape or you can say which allow the gases to escape is known as is known as permeability i hope you understand the question i uh, understand what is basically it that means uh, if uh, the ability of the molding sand to escape the uh, gases right is known as permeability and that therefore you can say if you know the basic of casting then this is really important that it, it will allow the gases to escape because if gas will be in the mold then what will happen the defects will be more in the casting which for which material we are casting right so that is also important now basically what you need to learn so if you are preparing for university examination then understanding the thing is important definition is also important but if you are for if you are preparing for competitive examination just like gate and this video is for gate because i am i am just telling you basic thing as well as the other part of this video tutorial i am going to share with you a question which question has been asked in gate previous year paper right so, so the the main key for gate is uh, numerical problems right so here is the formula for finding out permeability number pn is equal to bh by pat and probably you don't know what is v what is uh, h what is p what is a and what is t if you will come to know then you will understand what is this so pn means what let me uh, make you understand what is pn one by one we'll understand right pn means permeability permeability number v means volume of the air volume of the air passing through through it right and h is height of the standard uh, specimen height of the standard specimen and what remaining a area and t time remember time we will take in minute and all data will be in centimeter okay so in this problem what in uh, they ask in gate we are also maintaining this centimeter and minute okay so don't get confused in this and if you'll solve few problems then you'll understand what you need to take and what you don't need to take because this is important okay so what is here okay now permeability so uh, now let's go for that uh, problem but before going to uh, solve that problem let me share with you one thing that is uh, you know pressure always what is uh, yeah that is p is pressure this pressure always given i have seen numerical problems right gram per centimeter square and one thing is area can be find out by this formula pi by 4 into talking about h is equal to it uh, equivalent to d and it's equivalent to 2 inch 2 inch means 2 into 2.54 that means if i'll calculate 5.54 0.54 into 2 that is 5.08 5 5.08 centimeter because you know 1 inch is equal to how much 2.54 that's why we have written this so we got h the value of h and uh, we also got the value of uh, you know here what is area d so this uh, this d small d is equal to capital d let's say this so we can use only one that's why it will, you will not confuse right 
so this is all about the theoretical part of permeability now we'll go for that numerical problem which has been asked in gate so that's why you will have some approach to solve numerical problem in this topic only but the main formula is this p and permeability number equal to vh by pat this is important you need to remember this formula to solve numerical problems related to this problem related to this topic right so here is the question we got here and in this question what what we have as the permeability of molding sand was determined by using a standard sample and which is passing through 2000 cc of air so what is V basically 2000 cc 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 means cubic centimeter that means centimeter to the per cube remember this okay you usually we come to know how much cc bike is uh, in general the bike cc in cc because it's stand for volume right at uh, the gas pressure pressure is given how much 10 gram per uh, centimeter square okay if the time if the time taken for the air E to escape was so time is equal to one minute now we have to find out pn pn is equal to what well i have already shared with you if you are solving any gate medical problem and if you are not beginner if you're beginner then probably the concept i am just going to share with you will not work for you probably you will be in trouble if you will uh, follow that concept but if you know the concept of solving numerical problem in any topic then uh, my concept will help you a lot so if you are not beginner then what you should do you should uh, uh, first of all for solving any numerical problem formula is required if you know the formula that means you are not beginner you you have something right so first of all go to the end of the question just like here what you need to find out from that question and uh, here what we got the permeability number we need to find out that is pn is equal to what we should know so pn is equal to what vh by pat right so in order to get the value of pn we need to have values of all these things and from where we can get these values the, from this question only are you getting my point so i'm going little bit reverse okay yeah that's why it will be helpful for you and you will find out exact exactly what you require to know so what we needed here volume v actually we have given right now p p is given 10 area is not given time is given 1 area we have to find out and v we have given then we have to find out h as i have already shared with you h and d h is equal to d is equal to 5.08 so here just it is right 5.08 and i think yeah i have already shared with you yeah i'm just was seeing that uh, that piece i have already shared with you area is equal to what 5 by 4 into d square 5.08 square so this is um, i mean this is how you can got or information what you required exactly you just uh, don't need to read the question then that is the old method what method i am sharing with you this is the recent one if you follow this method you can solve numerical problem just like that i mean just find out what you need to find out from the numerical problem then write the formula then go for it okay so this is the shortest method and the right approach to solve numerical problems but to use or to implement this method you need to know something about the topic without that that's not possible to solve the problem okay right now what we have we got this equation and you know what we require right now can you guess can you guess my dear can you guess yeah i think so you can guess but i don't know you can guess or not but yes we require we, we right now we require calculator so yes yes I got calculator right so 2000 multiple 5.08 divided 10 into 1 don't need to write but even then I'm writing okay so uh, it's pi okay just a second pi by 4 d square 5.08 a square bracket close so what we got here 550 point 1275 so can you see the answer which answer is right for uh, this uh, question i hope you can see right so the answer right answer for this question is a so basically for solving this question what we required we need to have this formula first and we need to have all things that we know in which unit the things will be this should not be changed in 
second if you change then you are not going to get answer so that is not the way to solve the problem so what we have understand in this problem i mean in this row 12 we have understand what is probability what is its formula and all things we have used in this formula in details so this is all about permeability. I hope you understand you grab something new from this video tutorial. Thanks for watching. See you soon in my next video. Bye bye.